let's get to it. What's up everyone, it's Chris, and I'm going out today because we got some snow coming down. It's been a, a year of not much snow. There's only been one snow day before this, and even then it only lasted a couple hours before it rained and ruined all that. So I only got a couple pictures last time, and I wanna take advantage of the snow that we got going on right now. The video I put up recently showing my Mavic Air 2, uh, I'm gonna be using that again today to try to get some cool stuff with the snow uh, in the pine trees. My favorite thing about pine trees is that even in the winter when all the other plants and other trees are dead, the pine trees still look amazing and honestly they even look better in the snow. Uh, I got two spots I pretty much wanna go to. The first one is uh, my first stop, that's Atzean Lake and that's um, really beautiful. The other stop that I might get to on my way back is another small lake. It's kind of a campground, but um, there's a lake and a lot of the pine trees around there as well. Something else important. <laughs> if you watched my last video at the beach uh, when I was flying my drone, my hands were freezing. I didn't have the right kind of gloves because uh, I couldn't touch the screen with the gloves that I had. Um, found them. <laughs> I found gloves that I have. They're pretty thin, but they do have the uh, finger uh, touchpad thing so hopefully they work and hopefully they keep my hands warm enough they're not completely exposed at least so I think it'll be somewhat of an improvement All right. cool beans dude you really zipped around me got my coffee here obviously uh, it's the only thing that's gonna keep me warm here aside from my 20 layers of clothes but um, coffee definitely essential out in the snow All right, so I pulled over real quick. Uh, we're not at the lake just yet, but um, this is a really cool spot where there's a lot of pine trees right here. I actually have the drone on top of my car. Uh, I'm gonna take it off right now. Here he goes. You might've heard that. <laughs> so there he goes. I'm just gonna record this so you can see what I'm shooting at. You can see some of this is way overexposed, but I wanted to do this just so you could still see enough of what's going on. And see, now that I'm only focusing on the trees, really it is uh, good enough. Oh, this is nice. You know what? Let me make sure my uh, white balance is correct, because I had that set from yesterday. Okay, changed it. Cool. Nice, this is very cool. So I'm just gonna do kind of a slow panning shot here, straight down on the trees. Basically what I'm gonna do today is just kinda of get a lot of different shots. Oh, this is just so nice. Even if there's not a lot of snow in the trees, just that snow on the ground makes such a cool difference. Oh man, yeah, look at this tree that's fell down too. Okay, and now it's too bright, so I'm gonna stop that one. Let's go up higher though. So right now I'm only about 200 feet up, so. Oh yeah. Okay, now I got up a lot higher. See, I'm actually gonna get right over this road, which is gonna be awesome. And there's no cars coming by. I kind of wish there was. It'd be a cool subject to have in here, but still. I'm gonna go up even higher now. Maybe let's do it sideways this time. I got my uh, rule of thirds grid line on here so that I can really Make sure that the road is perfectly straight across. And I am just pushing the stick to the left, so it goes left. It's pretty much that easy with a drone. Oh, look at that car go by, yes. <laughs> Actually, we got another car coming by too, so I'm gonna just go for this. Move forward, and slowly, 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 I'm gonna pan the gimbal up. This car comes by. And get this very cool shot panning up to reveal the whole forest up there. The drone is being really such a champ up in the snow right now. He's really taking it. I wouldn't want to do it in the rain because I think that's a little too risky with how wet it would be. But snow, um, surprisingly handling it very well. So um, we got another car coming by. Get my shutter speed right, hurry up. All right, and go for it. Ugh, 
What do you pull over for? You ruined my shot, buddy. All right, I think it's time to get back. Bring the old boy back home, get to the lake. See if we get anything different there. Here he comes, and... There he is. Landing. Grab him real quick. Nice. Got some cool shots here. So, onto the lake. Let's see if we can get anything a little bit different. And, um... See you guys in a few minutes. <laughs> All right, it's been about 30 seconds of me driving and I just had another really cool idea. This, uh, as you can see in those last clips, it's just a really long stretch of straight road through the woods here. Uh, and there's really no cars that come by very often. So I am just gonna put up the drone again and just fly it straight down the road through the trees here. Um, this car just drove by, but there's nobody behind me and nobody in front of me I can see. So uh, let me just jump out real quick, turn the drone on. Just pop them down on the street there. And it should just take a couple seconds for the remote to connect and I will have him take off. And da, 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 there he is. Start recording just so you guys can see. And take off. And up he goes. Take off. Go home. Please check it on the map. <laughs> Only a few minutes away now. Really not even a few minutes. A little closer than that. Still not seeing too much of the snow sticking to the trees themselves, but the fact that it's sticking to the ground still makes it look really nice. Oh man, the lake is just covered with snow. It's perfect. <laughs> I can see it right now, right over there. Where it really opens up. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, yes. <laughs> Already, this is a good idea to come out here. Unless if the drone dies over the lake, and then I'm screwed, but uh... <laughs> but uh, so far, so good. So I can just pull right over here, in front of the lake. This is just really perfect <laughs> for um for getting these drone shots. And again, I brought my uh, my other Sony camera too, so um, you know I, I can actually get some regular photos and video here as well. But um, yeah, let's get up there. <laughs> 